Christ. In the name of the Lord Jesus Christ, we command the works of the flesh in the lives of the brethren to die. In the name of the Lord Jesus Christ, let the power of the cross and of the Holy Spirit be released to the grown flesh in our lives. In the name of the Lord Jesus Christ, Holy Father, release our spirits to control our souls. In the name of the Lord Jesus Christ, let the life of our Lord Jesus Christ be truly established in the body of Christ. In the name of the Lord Jesus Christ, every power of selfishness, overambition, and unteachableness be broken and destroyed in the name of the Lord Jesus Christ. Father, grant unto the body of Christ, the mind of Christ, forgiving spirit, tolerance, genuine repentance, understanding, submission, humility, brokenness, watchfulness, and the mind to commend others better than ourselves. In the name of the Lord Jesus Christ, we challenge and pull down the forces of disobedience in the lives of the saints in the name of the Lord Jesus Christ. We command these blessings on the body of Christ and the ministers of God. Love, joy, peace, long-suffering, gentleness, goodness, faith, meekness, temperance, divine healing, divine health and wealth, fruitfulness, progress, faith, the gifts of healing, prophecy, discerning of spirits, the word of wisdom, the word of knowledge, the working of miracles, diverse kinds of tongues, the interpretation of tongues, beauty and glory of God, righteousness and holiness, dedication and commitment. Father, create the thirst and hunger for God and holiness in our lives. In the name of the Lord Jesus Christ. O oh Lord, send down the fire of revival into the body of Christ. Lord, break and refill your ministers and vessels afresh. Let them be a full and fresh outpouring of the Holy Ghost upon the ministers of God in the name of the Lord Jesus Christ. O oh Lord, give unto your ministers the power for effective prayer life. O oh Lord, release faithful, committed, dedicated, and obedient laborers into the vineyard in the name of the Lord Jesus Christ. We break down the authority and dominion of Satan over the souls of men in the name of the Lord Jesus Christ. Every spirit holding the souls of men in captivity, we shatter your backbone in the name of the Lord Jesus Christ. Every covenant between the souls of men and Satan, we dash you to pieces in the name of the Lord Jesus Christ. Let the spirit of steadfastness, consistency, hunger, and thirst for the word of God come upon the converts in the name of the Lord Jesus Christ. O oh Lord, release upon all our missionaries and evangelists fresh fire to disgrace territorial spirits. We break the power and the grip of the world upon the souls of men in the name of the Lord Jesus Christ. We release the spirit of salvation upon areas that have not been reached by the gospel in the name of the Lord Jesus Christ. O oh Lord, remove all the hindrances to your purpose for Christian homes in the name of the Lord Jesus Christ. We command the spirit of quarrel, immorality, unfaithfulness, infirmity, disagreement, misunderstanding, and intolerance to lose their grips upon Christian homes in the name of the Lord Jesus Christ. 
Let all Christian homes be a light to the world and a vehicle of salvation in the name of the Lord Jesus Christ. Oh God, raise up Esther, Ruth, and Deborah in this generation in the name of the Lord Jesus Christ. Every power destroying joy in the home be dismantled in the name of the Lord Jesus Christ. Oh Lord, Grant us special wisdom to train our children in your glory. Every Christian marriage that has been rearranged by the enemy be corrected in the name of the Lord Jesus Christ. Oh Lord, let the spirit of wisdom, judgment, submission, gentleness, obedience to God's word, and faithfulness in the home. Every spirit. 
brightly upon us in the name of the Lord Jesus Christ. Lord Jesus Christ, plant us in our financial Eden in the name of the Lord Jesus Christ. Oh God, cause all our allies to find us in the name of the Lord Jesus Christ. O oh, creator of heaven and earth, reveal to us the hidden treasures that you have for us and bring us to them in the name of the Lord Jesus Christ. Wisdom of heaven, come to us by our finances. Every good financial seed that we have planted, lying dormant in the soil, water find you, light find you, and sprout and bring forth abundant fruit in the name of the Lord Jesus Christ. O oh, wisdom of Solomon, come to us for finances in the name of the Lord Jesus Christ. Money and favor, find us now in the name of the Lord Jesus Christ. O oh Lord, guide us to our financial wells in the name of the Lord Jesus Christ. O oh God who sees, cause the waters of abundance to flow to us and our households in the name of the Lord Jesus Christ. O oh Lord, let the anointing of Joseph abound in our lives in the name of the Lord Jesus Christ. We are tithers and givers, therefore, Windows of help be open and pour out all our blessings to us in the name of the Lord Jesus Christ. Let us find the palm trees in every desert in our finances in the name of the Lord Jesus Christ. Every wall of Jericho in our finances collapse now in the name of the Lord Jesus Christ. O oh Lord, bless us in the land of our affliction with abundance. In the name of the Lord Jesus Christ. Let the creative ideas that you give us make us rich and further the kingdom of God. In the name of the Lord Jesus Christ. Liberality and generosity are our portion. In the name of the Lord Jesus Christ. Thank you, Holy Father. Thank you, Lord Jesus. Thank you, Lord Jesus. Thank you, Holy Spirit. Thank you. Well, next to the prayers for correction in your finances. Amen. Tree of life, be resurrected in our lives. Tree of life, be resurrected in our lives. Tree of life, be resurrected in our lives. Lord Jesus Christ, make the dry places fertile in our finances. In the name of the Lord Jesus Christ. Oh Lord, unlock all the padlocks on our treasure chests. In the name of the Lord Jesus Christ. Blood of the Lord Jesus Christ. Rebuke the devourer in our finances. In the name of the Lord Jesus Christ. Every diversion of our financial blessings away from us. O oh Lord, reverse the diversion and cause the finances to flow to us now. In the name of the Lord Jesus Christ. O oh God, make the crooked way straight in our finances. Every fight for our finances in the spirit realm be one in our favor in the name of the Lord Jesus Christ. Ground that was iron and sky that was brass in our finances turn back to fertile soil and abundant rain in our finances in the name of the Lord Jesus Christ. Let our seeds always find good soil in the name of the Lord Jesus Christ. Oh God, Defend our finances in Jesus Christ's name. Lord Jesus Christ, repair every busted gate in our finances in the name of the Lord Jesus Christ. Every lock on our finances that does not have a key, we knock you loose in the name of the Lord Jesus Christ. Every financial bullet be flipped on your head in the name of the Lord Jesus Christ. All tears among our hearts, burn yourself up in the name of the Lord Jesus Christ. All treasure chests with our name on them, find us now in the name of the Lord Jesus Christ. Oh God, show us as you showed Jacob how to make strong what is weak in our finances in the name of the Lord Jesus Christ. Oh God, for every Goliath we kill, Cause us to 
to be paid well in the name of the Lord Jesus Christ. King of David, come to us and unlock every door closed against us in the name of the Lord Jesus Christ. Oh God, more than enough, bring our finances from the prison to the palace, just as you did for Joseph, in the name of the Lord Jesus Christ. Oh God, I honor you with our, we honor you with our money all of the days of our lives in the name of the Lord Jesus Christ. Every hanging in our finances, hang yourself in the name of the Lord Jesus Christ. Spirit of man, we are not your dwelling place in the name of the Lord Jesus Christ. Oh God, open your good treasures unto us now in the name of the Lord Jesus Christ. May our treasure and our heart always remain with you, God, regardless of our financial status, in the name of the Lord Jesus Christ. Thank you, Holy Father. Thank you, Lord Jesus Christ. Thank you, Holy Spirit. That concludes our prayers. It is time to praise and worship the Lord for his word. You love him with all your heart, with all your soul, with all your mind, and all your strength. God, we just love you. We adore you, oh precious King. We love your name today. We thank you for another opportunity to bless you in your presence, to stand before you, to sing to you, to love on you, and let you know how much we love you, how much we adore you, how much we thank you for being such a kind God, for being such a good God, for being everything that we need. For being our healer, our deliverer, our waymaker, our strong tower, we say thank you. This morning, there is nobody like him nowhere. There is no other God before him. There is nobody as awesome as he is for us to do the things that he does. Nobody can make miracles the way that he does. And we just love him this morning. Oh, God, how we love you this morning. How we worship you, how we bless your name, how we adore you. How we thank you today for being our Father, for being our King, for being our Lord. We bless your name this morning. We love you with all our hearts today. Thank you, Lord. I really love you. I really love you.
Christ. Amen. It causes us to triumph in Amen. every situation. Thank you. And we thank God. And through Him, we do valiantly. This is the day the Lord has made. I will rejoice and be glad in it. Amen. Praise the wonderful name of the Lord Jesus Christ. Thank you so much. Reverend Granger. Amen. Happy to see Sister Joan back. Amen. 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 You know, I'm just glad that God told us how to pray. Amen. Thank you, Lord. Well, I tell you, that is a distinct difference in my life. Thank you, Lord. Amen. I know there's one in your life because yes, I see it. so wonderful. Amen. And he doesn't have to be this good to be God. Amen. But I'm sure glad he is. How about you? Hallelujah. Pastor's our Pastor Samson, our Amen. Samson Jr. He's out today. Amen. 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 Fooling with his birthday. Amen. <laughs> Why you say it like that? Because I feel good inside. Amen. <laughs> Amen. I'm grateful to God to see all of you this morning. Amen. I'm just so grateful that God hasn't dealt with us after anything like sin. Thank you, Lord. Thank you, Lord. He's not rewarded us according to our iniquity. Amen. And He's merciful to forgive us. Yes, sir. And gracious to prosper us to see yet another day. Thank you, God. Hallelujah. Gave me another chance. Yes, sir. Amen. 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 So some folks, you know, they say they're ready to go, but they've been saying it for years. Mm -hmm. So something ain't quite lining up, is it? Amen. You ain't ready because you're saved. Amen. Amen. You're ready when you complete your assignment. Amen. And the Lord says you're ready. Amen. 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 Praise the Lord. Well, what path it takes some folk longer to get ready? That ain't none of my business. Amen. Amen. <laughs> Amen. 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 That ain't none of my business. Amen. I'm trying to do what the Lord told me to do. Amen. 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 As a matter of fact, I'm in my six months of letting the other folks sit in the lungs. Amen. 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 Six months for you to mind your business. Amen. And six months for you to leave other folks business alone. Amen. Amen. Yes. Praise, the Praise the Lord. I'm just grateful, children. The Lord is so good. Yes, he is. He's yes, so he is. kind. Yes, yes. And you know, he just keeps on doing great things. Yes, he does. Thank you, Lord. I hope you three got some kind of way to sing that today. Okay. If you will, please. Thank you, Lord. Amen. 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 When I get through. Amen. Amen. I don't Amen. intend to be long today. Amen. Amen. Preaching, that is. Amen. 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 Did you show me what song I'm doing? Well, let's start that. Right. Hallelujah. 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 Thank you, Lord Jesus. Thank you, Lord Jesus. I'll never. Let go God's hand He's done so much for me I'll never I'll never let go Never let go God's hand. I'll never let go His hand. He has done 
so much, so much for me.
thank you now, Lord, you taught us that when we continue in your word, we show ourselves to be your disciples indeed, and that we will know the truth. Yes. And the truth will make us free. So we thank you right now you, for the freedom we receive from your word. Thank you, Father. You taught us that your word is a lamp to our feet, a light to our pathway. Yes. We will not stumble, we will not lose our way. Thank you. I pray, dear God, that every person who will hear this sermon today. I pray, Holy Father, that their needs are met. Yes. In the name of the Lord Jesus Christ, we thank you, Lord, and ask that let not a sentence of my own be used, but those of what the Spirit of God dictates. The words of our mouths and meditations of our hearts be acceptable in your sight, O oh Lord, our strength and our redeemer. We give you the glory because it belongs to you. And we ask, dear God, that you would Open our hearts to receive today. In the name of the Lord Jesus Christ, we do pray with thanksgiving. All agree with that prayer. Say amen. Amen. Colossians chapter 3, verse 15. And I might go tell y'all now, I already got what I came for today. You're there, you see these words. Let the peace of God rule in your hearts. Yes, sir. To the which also you are called in one body. Mm -hmm. And be ye thankful. Subject. Let peace be the umpire All right. All right. in your heart. I'm proud of referee, you know, those mean the same thing depending on what sports being played. Mm. I like to amplify it, it reads that the peace, soul harmony which comes from Christ, rule, act as umpire continually in your hearts, mm. deciding and settling with an all finality all questions that arise in your minds in that peaceful state All right. to which as members of Christ's one body you were also called to live and be thankful appreciative yes, sir. giving praise to God always that the word spoken by Christ verse 16 the Messiah had his home in your hearts and minds and dwell in you in all its richness as you teach and admonish and train one another in all insight and intelligence and wisdom and spiritual things as you sing and as you sing psalms and hymns and spiritual songs making melody to God with his grace in your heart. Verse 17, and whatever you do, no matter what it is, in word or deed, do everything in the name of the Lord Jesus and in dependence upon his person, giving praise to God for the Father through him. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Bless the wonderful name of the Lord Jesus Christ. Yes, Lord. I confess and I say that Jesus the Christ is my Lord and personal Savior. Yes, this past Monday, 67 years ago, yes, I gave my heart to the Lord Jesus. Lord there's no redemption in any other name other than the Amen. name of the Lord Jesus Christ. Amen. The Lord Jesus Christ is the way. He is the truth. He is the life. No man comes to the Father but by him. Amen. I want to say this morning to our visitors, we thank you. Amen. Amen, Amen. for joining with us today. Amen. Amen. You make our services very special. Amen. Amen. And you're always welcome to worship with us at any of our gatherings, Amen. in person or virtually. Amen. 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 We're here at 1180 Washington Boulevard, Beaumont, Texas, on the corner of Washington Boulevard and Victoria Streets. Amen. We're here every Sunday morning. Amen. We begin worship at 8.30 a.m. And on Wednesdays at 6.30 p.m., you may find us on Facebook. Amen. 
amen at 6.30 p.m. Amen. If you don't have a church home, you're here in Beaumont, Texas, or wherever you are, you need to join this church. Amen. If you're not in close proximity outside of the city or state or country, you may still be a part of this church. Amen. There's a space on our website, gtcfc.org, amen, where you can fill out the form to become our member. Also on that page, you will see the benefits of membership. Amen. 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 God spoke something to me 20 years ago today. Hmm. November the 12th. In 2003, mile high time flies. All right. These are the words he said to me. He said, you must receive a personal peace hmm. that God will do it for you. Yes. And you can be all that God said. And that you can do all that God said. All right. Peace is very important. Yes, yes it is. Yes, yes, it yes is. sir. If you ever get to the place where you don't have any, you will really discover just how important it is. Yes. Peace comes from God to conquer fear in our lives. Amen. John 14, 27, our Lord Jesus says, Peace I leave with you, my peace. I give unto you, not as the world gives, give it I unto you. Let not your heart be troubled, neither let it be afraid. Yes. It gives us peace that our hearts won't be troubled yes, sir. and that we won't be afraid. Yes. And I want to say, don't ever even try to understand peace. Amen. Help us, Lord. Help us, Lord. Don't try to understand it. The scripture is clear. Philippians 4. Six and seven, these are the words that be careful for nothing or be anxious for nothing, but in everything by prayer and supplication and thanksgiving, let your requests be made known unto God. Yes. And the peace of God, Ooh. which passes all understanding, Thank you, Lord. shall keep your hearts and minds through Christ Jesus. Yes. I want to do my best to persuade you today to let peace be umpire in your heart. Yes. Let peace rule. Let peace be the referee. Amen. Thank you, Lord. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. As we encourage the scripture, let the peace of God rule yes. in your hearts. Yes, to the which also you are called in one body, that is the body of our Lord Jesus, the body of Christ. Yes. And then it adds on in be thankful. Yes, sir. Amen. Amen. That peace, it comes from God. Yes. You already have it. Thank you, Lord. you don't have to go get it. All right, you Lord. But you're going to have to protect it. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Isaiah 26, 3. That will keep him in perfect peace. Whose mind is stayed on thee. Because he trusts that. That he trusts. Amen. Continually in thee. All right. I want to say you have to protect peace. By getting under it. Mm -hmm. Let peace cover you. Yeah. Let it rule. Let it call the issues in life. Or I can say let it call this game called life. Yeah. Mm -hmm. My Lord. Let it rule by making the decisions of peace final. Yes, sir. Don't go back and revisit it. All right. Don't second guess it. Yeah. Thank, you, Lord Jesus. Thank you Lord Jesus. Let the decisions of peace stand regardless of spectators. Situations and circumstances. I want to say whatever they say, accept peace. Yes, sir. And accept peace's decision. Yes, man. Situations and circumstances. They, they try to predict and decide for you, but you have to let peace rule. Yes, sir. Hallelujah. Yes, sir. And then that, that, that uh, uh, spectators and situations and Circumstance will try to referee your life. Uh -huh. Wanting to put that two cents in. Yeah. You call yeah. Trying to make decisions for you. That's about control. That's all that is. Mm -hmm. And it's funny to me to learn how folk have advice and 
instructions for you yeah. in matters they know nothing about. Yeah. They put on a referee uniform yeah. and they try to call the game. Folks yeah. so ain't never been married, can't give a married person advice. Yeah. Hallelujah. I said, never been married. Even if they got the divorce, they've been married. They know something. Amen. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. And dollars get you donuts if they've been in divorce. It's because it was needed. Yes, sir. Amen. And for you folks, I want to say again, talking about divorce and sin, you need to read the Bible. Amen. Divorce is God's idea. Amen. But I want to say, Amen. let peace have the final word. Yeah. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. You see, in the game, you know, the referee. He can put players out. Oh, yeah. okay. He can put the coaches out. He can put the managers out of the stadium. Yep. And if someone disrespects your peace, you need to throw them out. Yeah. Say throw them out. Throw them yes, out. Sir. Yes, sir. Yes, Let's sir. review some decisions of peace. Yes, sir. When helplessness tries to cut me off. Mm. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. You know what peace going to do? Peace don't say too many men on the field. All right. Thank you, Lord Jesus. Because I can do all things through Christ who strengthens me. Low self-esteem tries to trip me. Peace throws a flag for offside. False start. Thank you, Lord Jesus. You can't make it no way. Amen. Word about your image. Help me, Lord Jesus. 1 Corinthians 15, 10. But by the grace of God, I am what I am. And his grace was bestowed upon me was not in vain, but I labored more abundantly than they all, yet not I, but the grace of God, which was with me. Doubt, you know, it, it, it comes in and, and tries to quit. Hallelujah. Peace is going to call a penalty. <laughs> Thank you, Lord Jesus. Thank you, Lord Jesus. 2 Corinthians 2 and 4. Now, thanks be unto God, which always causes us to triumph in Christ and make it manifest the savor of his knowledge by us in every place. Yes. Darkness. Somebody here know about darkness? Yeah. And darkness tries to sack my peace. Mm. Peace calls, hallelujah, illegal man in motion. All right, now. <laughs> Thank you, Lord Jesus. I'm reminded of Psalm 119, 105. Your words are laughing to my feet. Oh, yeah. And a light of my pathway. Yes, when lack tries to get me in fear, peace calls it a past interference. Uh -huh. <laughs> it wasn't intended for me. Thank you, Lord Jesus. Thank you, Lord. For the Lord is my shepherd. Oh, yeah. Thank you, Lord. I shall not want. When sickness and disease tries to tackle me, Peace calls an unnecessary roughness. All right, all right, all right. I said 53.5, but he was wounded yeah. for my transgression. Yes, he was bruised for our iniquities, the chastisement of our peace was upon him and with his stripes. Yes, yes, yes. We are here. Yeah. And sadness tries to take me down. Peace calls a replay. Yeah. Thank you, Lord Jesus. Yeah. Because the joy of the Lord Amen. is my strength. Yeah. You see, personal peace comes from the Prince of Peace. Yes, sir. And it does not need to be validated. It does not need to be approved. It, it, it needs to be reassured by anyone on earth. Feelings of helplessness yes, sir. attempt to rob you of your peace. Yes, sir. But if you ask God what's going on and he's silent, you get somewhere and be quiet and enjoy the peace of God. Yes, yes. See, I have to say to you this morning that the Lord spoke to me 20 years ago. And spoke to me again this week past. That you must receive the personal peace yes, that God's going to do it for you. Yes. How many of you know that God can do it for you? Yes. I'm saying you got to claim for a lot of stuff. Yeah, he, he gets blamed for a lot of stuff. Amen. The Lord gives you the Lord take it away. It's in the Bible, but it ain't the truth. Amen. Amen. Thank you, Lord Jesus. Thank you, Lord Jesus. 
See, Job didn't have a Moses. He didn't have an Abraham. Job was older than them. Right. Job was the oldest book in the Bible, but I tell you what, he did is you evil. Mm -hmm. And he's just like me when I can't find something in the house. What you do with it to burn? But then nobody else that. Right. All Job had in his life was God. So when he lost stuff, he said, the Lord give it. Yeah. The Lord take it away. It's the truth that he said it. But if you read it, it was not God who did it. Yeah. He gets blamed for a lot of stuff that he doesn't do. Yeah. But I tell you what, if you come up on the crazy, God will work it out. Yes, he will. Yes. Oh, yes, he will. Yes, he will. That, that, that you must receive the personal peace. Yes, sir. That God's going to work it out. Yes, sir. Yes. Regardless of the helplessness you may feel. Yes. That you, you must receive the personal peace that you can do what God told you to do. Because yes, he's not going to use your credentials no how. Yes, he's not looking to your ability. Yes. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. He has the power. Yes. And he will impute it to us yes, to do his will. Yes. That, that when the game gets tight, oh, yes. you know it'll get tight sometimes. Yes, sir. When the game gets tight, I say, yes, sir. you may not always agree with the referee. But let him rule. Yes, sir. Let peace rule. Glory yes. Then I've seen some tight games. Yeah. And the victory went to the team that did not win on merit. All right, man. In these cases, we say the referee won his own. All right, all right. Because you've got to know, children, that nobody can beat me and the referee. All right, all right. Is anybody here in there? You can't beat me and the referee. Yes, sir. Yes. When I let peace be the referee, when I let yes. peace be the umpire in my life, nothing yes, sir. can stop me. Yes. He thinks I hear him say, I'm going before you. Yes. And, and I'm fighting for you. Yes. And nothing can stop us now. Yes. I want to say, love it. If you can't win on your own merit, yeah. let peace, yes, the umpire, yes, the referee, yeah. let him win for you. Yeah. Yes. I've seen some games where the victory was overturned All right. yeah. Yeah. and the winner lost uh. by disqualification. Yeah. And will you let peace yes. be the referee? Yeah. He's going to call the game in your faith. Yeah. See, in your heart, yeah. you always win. Yeah. Because peace has the power yes, sir. Yeah. to disqualify the death yes, sir. and give you the victory. Thank you, Lord. And I want to say in this final word of this text, yeah. and be thankful. Mm. Be appreciative. Yeah. Amen. Crazy things that happen in your life did not come from God. Amen. Amen. Crazy things in your life yes, sir. did not come from the God of glory. Yes, but I know somebody, uh -huh. mm -hmm, the Prince of Peace, yes, sir. he'll work it out for you. Yes, he will. I know the Lord things work together for good to them that love the Lord and who are the call according to his purpose. But did you really hear what it said? It said all things are bad things. Raggedy things, good things, nice things, all things means everything. Tell somebody, cheering God is gonna work it out for you. Yes, you will. Did anybody here know that God can work it out? God is able. Yes, He is. Mm -hmm. To make all grace 
abound toward you. Always having all sufficiency in all things that you may abound to every good work. Mm, be thankful. God can do more with a grateful heart than he does with a complaining tongue. I don't know why Jesus loved me. I don't know why Jesus cared. And I don't know why he sacrificed his life. But I'm glad. Are you glad? I'm glad that he did. Thank you, Lord Jesus. I don't know why he had to die. But I'm glad that he did die. Thank you, Lord Jesus. But I got good news. He didn't stay dead. He was in the grave for three days and three nights. But right Sunday morning, he got up from the grave with all power. Heaven and earth in his hand. The King of peace. The Prince of Peace, he walks in me, he pauses in me, God on my feet, he holds my hand. Hey, all right, there's something in the way he moves, there's something in the things that he does. I cannot always express it, pictures can't draw it past. I have to say he's all right and the Lord all right. Hey, all right. I know that the Lord is all right. Hallelujah. I guess you got it figured out by now that I didn't come to preach all day. But I want to tell you to let the peace of God rule in your heart. Everything, yes, everything is gonna be alright. Hallelujah. That room at the cross for you. Many of the times I'm one of them, but still that room. Thank you, Lord Jesus. Thank you, Lord Jesus. Do you have his peace? Don't fool me, children. Do you have his peace? I've got the peace of God ruling in my heart. Thank you, Lord. Thank you, Lord Jesus. Thank you, Lord Jesus. That room at the cross.
I gave God my heart. Hallelujah. And accept the Lord Jesus as my Savior. He was a Tuesday morning. And I'm so grateful to God for that day. And today can be your day. Now if you believe it, I can't believe for you, but I can help you with the same. Just say these words with you, Jesus. Holy Father, I know without Jesus I'm lost. I believe your word. And if I confess with my mouth the Lord Jesus and believe in my heart that God will raise him from the dead that I shall be saved. I believe your word. I now invite Jesus the Christ come into my life. I receive you by faith as my Lord and Savior. I ask you to forgive me of my sins. I'm sorry for my sins. And I thank you for your forgiveness. And I repent of every wrong thing I've done. Lord Jesus, I ask you to fill me with your Holy Spirit. Manifest in me the gift of the Holy Ghost. As you will. Word of wisdom, the word of knowledge, the gift of faith, the gifts of healing, working of miracles, prophecy, discerning of spirits, speaking in tongues, and interpreting tongues, so that I can serve you the rest of my life. Dear Jesus, I accept you as my Lord. Sit on the throne of my life. I'm a new creature in Christ. And I declare that I am a child of God. According to the word of God. Thank you for saving me. Thank you for filling me with your spirit. In the name of the Lord Jesus Christ I pray. Amen. at the cross for you to yes, God believe you now yes. you are joining us personally we thank God for you spending your time with us today there's no distance in the spirit I trust that something has been said today give you a lift and that's what peace does gives us a lift and if you decide to always hold on to your peace, not another crazy day will ruin your life. Thank you for being with us. Join us on Wednesday at 6 30. Pastor R. R. Samson Jr. has a word in his mouth that's going to help you and change your life. We'll be here again on Sunday at 8 30. We begin our worship. And it's live right here, Lemonade, Washington, Brother Lord, Beaumont, Texas. I pray the peace of God that passes all understanding. Mount Garrison over your heart and mind through Christ Jesus. Thank you for being with us today. God bless us.